Hi everyone, I'm Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about a week of noise. We have two parts to our room design service. We have treatment, which is the absorption and diffusion inside the room. And then we have barrier technology, which is the shell or reducing noise transmission, noise leaving the room bothering others, noise from others coming into the room bothering you when you're listening or working, whatever you're doing in the room. So. In order to really get a handle on noise, we have to measure over a whole week. And we have apps that we send you. You download them on your phone and then you record the data per our instructions on our online data sheet and you send it back to us. And then we send you a drawing that you can build or give to a contractor to bid for you. So we, we're looking for the quietest and the loudest part of each day. Those are called mins and maxes. So, Mins and max is, is the lowest pressure during the week, and the max is the highest pressure during the week. Some days are noisier than others. Well, when we design, we got to design for the maximum pressure. And then anything less than the max will be okay, will be treated, and, and will be okay there. There's a big difference in noise barrier technology if your problem is below 125. The cost double and triple versus problem above 125. What's above 125? Voice, stuff like that. What's below? Kick drums, drums, bass guitar, electric guitar, a lot of instruments that transmit energy below 125. Okay? So the process, download the apps. We, we went through all that, record the data. Most people get it right the first time. We've done, I don't know, 1,200 of these, and they work pretty well. The system is is pretty good. So so then we analyze and then we provide you a barrier drawing. This ta whole process takes about four weeks. Okay. So we have give you a DIY approach with drawings where you can build it yourself, a material list. Word of caution when you're dealing with contractors. We see it a lot, so I'm going to pass it on to you. Do not use the word acoustic when you're bidding the job. Well, this is a, an acoustic room. This is a soundproof room. This is, don't. Don't use that word because when you use that word, contractors think they're going to have to have some kind of exotic materials. They're going to have to install these materials a certain way. And it's just not true. All our methodologies are standard construction materials and standard construction methodologies. But if you use this word, it, it interjects uncertainty into the bid and to cover themselves for that uncertainty they'll raise the price i see 25 to 35 percent increases when that word is used so just don't use it it's a room for your music that's it it's a music room and here's what how you want it built but don't use the word acoustic because when they see the drawing and the design they'll say oh well this is no big deal but in the beginning if you use that word you know, they'll increase the price because they don't know what they're going to be facing and they don't want to lose money. I understand. But you can't, you know, artificially inflate uh, proposal costs because you don't know what's involved. That's, you need to get a new contractor. So you show them the drawing. Here's what we need. Here's the material list. How much to build it. Pretty simple. A week of noise. We got to have a pressure map, if you will, over the whole week. The ups and the downs, because some weeks, some days are noisier than others. We all know that. A week of noise. I hope this helps. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video, and if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to, so please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions and I usually get a chance every couple days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis. So that'll help you. Thank you.